Starting off in Foot Locker, we have some new retros I haven't seen last time I was here. Let's check it out. We're starting off Burgundy 5, still sitting. These definitely need to go on sale. The suede is nice. It's an old colorway that I brought back, but the suede, man, very nice, but they need to go on sale. Craft Fives, what? Craft Fives, the suede, very hairy on these. I'm not crazy about the material switch up. I think that threw a lot of people off. And once again, retail, too high. They got a lower retail. These need to go on sale, these two. Over here, we do have some sevens that I haven't seen in a while. These are the citrus, I believe, sevens. Citrus sevens, $200 retail. I'm surprised these are here. What size are these? I'm not sure, it's a men's size, that's for sure. It looks like it's my size, to be honest. Maybe a 10? Yeah, I'm surprised these are here. Citrus 7s. These weren't here last time I was here. I'm shocked those are here as well as the 12s. Hmm. Shocking. This is more like a Lakers colorway. I'm surprised these retros are really sitting. Things are really going back to normal, huh? That's for sure. You know, it wasn't like this years ago. I will say that, but yeah. The 12s sitting. What else do we have sitting here? We got some lows, all white. Can't go wrong with the leather quality. Not great, but then we got the mids. Some more mids. See, this is what I'm talking about. They're doing too much. Same colorways, just throwing the colors around. They're doing too much with the mids. It's it's nonsense. They're doing too much. But right here, we got some Team Jordans just sitting. These nines will forever be on sale at 150. That's not bad, but I think they're gonna drop it more. More Team Jordans on sale. Let's see what else? We do have some more Air Maxes on sale. 130, all black. TN Air Max 95, some more Air Max 95s for 80. Not bad, more Air Maxes. Definitely Air Max. Can't go wrong with the Air Maxes. I love personally, my favorite Air Max has to be the 90s, not this colorway at all. This colorway is ugly to me, but I do like Air Max 90s, probably the best. Or Air Max 1s, one of the two. I think those are the best. We've been seeing these, Harajis. Some other Nikes. Ooh, these, man. Very nice. Nice. Air Max 97s. I think the 97's pretty cool, but I'm not too crazy about the 97 personally. And let's see what else we have. We have more Blazers on sale. Ooh, what are these? I haven't seen these. Ooh, the leather quality. Very soft. Tumbled leather on those. What's this? Nike basketball. These are louder out there. Those are crazy for 70. What else is going on? Let's see. Blazers, Blazers, Air Force Ones, more Air Forces. What the heck are these? Like Sakai, like wannabe waffle, wannabe things. What the heck are these? What's going on? Jeez, doing too much, Nike. Doing too much. They take a thing that works and blast it on everything. And that's a prime example. We have more Air Force Ones. Ooh, roll back. And what else? What else? More Air Forces. Yeah. What are these? Ooh, Festos. Yeah, doing too much. Thank you, doing too much. Ooh, these. Once again, prime example. The Dunks, Panda Dunk Highs will for, I guess, sit forever now, huh? That's crazy. And then we have some other Dunks. I keep seeing those. Quality on that pair is very dope. If you guys know exactly what colorway that is, please leave a comment. Let me know. The quality is really nice on those compared to regular Nike Dunks. But. That's about it. Ooh, their tempos. Ooh, pennies up there. Not seeing too much. I don't see any foam posits. I wish we were seeing some foam posits right now. I don't see any foams. So next to the Jordans, they have the Puma section. And what the heck? We have to take a look at these. What the heck? They have like gold on them. Like actual jewelry on the shoe. One of one. They're definitely not a one of one, but these are crazy. These are wow, these are actually fire. I like the Pumas. If you guys know what these are, please let me know exactly. I don't know what they are, but the details, the wow, jewelry on the shoe. Absolutely crazy. Then we have more Pumas right here. Basketball, these are pretty cool. The mellows. 
cool. I'm guessing that's a pair of mellows as well. That would be my guess. I'm not sure what those are, but those are pretty crazy. And then they have the blue colorway as well. Yeah, it's got some more colorways of the mellows. So if you guys need some basketball shoes, I'm sure check your foot locker. They are on sale as well and some colorways. So they do definitely have stock. And yeah, definitely crazy. What the heck are these? Puma. Whoa. Those are crazy. Okay. Let's see what else they have here in Foot Locker. 13s. Whoa, I went right by these. I didn't even realize these were here. Next to the 12th, they do have the 13s as well. Need a new Nike fit, no cap. And they're $90, not bad. And then $80 for the pants. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to come back and I'm gonna have to cop. Which one should I get? Black, red, or the tannish beige color? I think I'm feeling that color, to be honest. Red's my favorite, but. I think I'm feeling that. And we have the New Balance section. The 550 right now is really popular. I'm looking for them. Where are they? The New Balance 550s. Where are they? Here they are. Here's some 550s. Boom. On sale too for $80. 550 New Balance. 550. It became like the most searched sneaker right now. Thanks to, I believe, Taylor Swift, which is crazy. And then we have some other New Balance models here. Yeah, definitely have a lot of New Balance. What are these, some energy New Balances? See, these are the New Balances. I just can't rock with this. It's too much of a dad shoe. The 550, not as much. If anything, I feel like I'd go with the 550 before I went with this, or even the 574s. I feel like this is too much for me, but if anything, the 550, more casual, I feel like, for me personally. Maybe, maybe, I might be able to pull it off. I'm not sure. 650s? I don't think so, but the 550 of all the New Balance models, maybe, maybe, or maybe even some of the protection pack because some of the protection pack is actually pretty fire as well. They do have a lot of New Balances here sitting at Foot Locker. Let me know, comment down below, what's your favorite New Balance model? What New Balance model am I missing out on? Please let me know down below in the comments. We took a look at the men's section. Let's take a look quickly at the grade school section. Let's see what's sitting first and foremost, the playoff. Air Jordan 8's grade school. Let's see what other retros happen to be sitting. Ooh, the 12s as well, like they are in men's. They're also sitting in grade school. Here's something that's not sitting over in the men's section, but they are in the grade school. Right here, we got the Toro 6s. Uh, as far as retros, not seeing anything else. Yeah, not seeing any other retros here in the grade school section. That's about it when it comes to retros here in grade school. But yeah, they have some really good sleepers sitting here at Foot Locker. I'm shocked. We got the Adidas section, and I'm taking a look at some Boost sneakers, and I realized, wow, they really have changed up the Boost. Now they're putting, like, writing on the Boost. They're also making black Boost. I noticed that. It's been a long time since I've seen. Actually, wow, we got some different colored Boost. I remember when Boost was only white. They would only make it in white, and now it seems like, yeah, they got boost in different colors. I haven't even realized that, to be honest with you. That's actually crazy. And they're going on sale, which is not shocking because the boost wave have definitely dropped. Damn, $80 retail, $180, I believe. And $80 on sale for some ultra boost. I just am over boost, man. I used to love it. I used to wear it all the time. I'm over it. I've been over it for years, but I did wear it a lot. Something I haven't worn at all is 4D. Let me know down below in the comments. How is 4D technology? Damn, these are crazy. The problem with 4D technology is it's too expensive for what you're getting. Retail was crazy expensive and people didn't feel like it was worth it. And I'm not sure if it is. Let me know down below in the comments. How is 4D if you've worn it before compared to Boost? Boost used to be life, but nah, not no more. Have a one Boost like that. Yeezys here and there, but that's about it. And speaking about Yeezys, Adidas, what are you doing? Jeez, I almost thought these were Yeezys for a second. Boost on sale here in 2023 years ago this would not have been the case at all jd can you open already please i do want to let you guys know look at my t-shirt i'm wearing the do not sell tea i just made it make sure you guys go cop they are available right now shop dannymore.com i'll have the link down below in the description for you and someone who cops is gonna get a pair of lost and found air jordan ones with their t-shirt so make sure you guys go cop link down below thank you guys so much for the love and support now let's go to champs champs before we walk in on the outer display i'm just seeing dub zero six rings team jordans nothing too crazy on the other side yeah just a bunch of t 
Hakeem Jordan. It's nothing crazy. Let's go inside. Here in Champs, they have an old Drake song playing. The new album is fire, but I'm not seeing too much sitting. We do have the One Rose right here, and some Citrons and other Team Jordans on sale. That's about it. I'm not seeing too much. I don't even have a big Jordan section at all. It's tiny. That's really it. Air Maxes on sale. These, nice, loud purple. I like it, I like it. That's about it. Some basketball sneakers, Nike basketball. Nike basketball has really died out. Flying it, and that's about it. I'm not seeing too much of runners. That's about it, I'm not seeing too much here at all in champs. As usual, this champs, dead man. I just spoke to the employee. She just told me this champs doesn't get releases like that. And yeah, I know that because they're like never on the flex app, which absolutely sucks. That's unfortunate. So yeah, this champs doesn't really have much at all. Nothing really to offer. Ugh, what a letdown. Ah, man, this champs. Man, they gotta start getting releases. I don't know why. It's in a mall. Ocean County Mall, but they just don't get releases here at Champs. Man, Jordan section. Tiny. It's not even the full section at all. Very small. What is this? Oh my god, they have Lost and Founds. Lost and Founds. What? Lost and Founds? No way, bro. No way. Wait, what? Oh. Oh my god, Lost and Founds. Wow. Can't get enough of this shoe, man. The Lost and Found Air Jordan 1s. I need more pairs. I keep wearing them. I definitely need more pairs of the Air Jordan 1. Lost and Found. These are straight fire. One of my favorite releases in the past handful of years. I love them. They did a great job. The theme, everything, the story. Great job with this shoe. See what else they have. They have a lot, man. I think still possibly Sneaker of the Year. The Reimagined 3s. Cardinal 3s. These are pretty slept on. Another three, I'm not too crazy about these, but those are pretty nice as well. Then we got the pandas. Phil Locker told me that they're getting pandas tomorrow. So maybe I'll pop back tomorrow, maybe get a pair of pandas. I could use a new pair, but at the same time, kind of over the dunks. I like Nike SBs so much better, but these are clean pair of Nike dunks. Here we go with some SBs. These are mids though. These are mid SBs. I like regular low SBs much better. Then we have some Jordan 1 Lowe's. These, I have these. Well, had them, I should say. I did sell them. I got rid of them. What else we have? We have those. What else? Oh, I got rid of these for a dollar. That was crazy. So, yeah, somebody got those for a dollar. Then we have these mids, the diamond short mids. They're coming out with another Bordeaux. It's like a lighter tone of this. I think it's going to sit. I don't really think people are really going to care for those, but this is a slept on must have right here. I, I'm sleeping myself on the 85 black and whites. Ooh, top three. Here's an expensive Jordan one you don't see too often. And we have the stage haze highs. Very, very dope. They have a lot, man. They have so many Jordan ones. My favorite shoe. What the heck are these? I've never seen these. Oh my goodness. These are those knit runners. These are definitely loud and out there. I don't know if I could even pull that off. I'm not sure. They have a lot of fours. Ooh, SB4s. I absolutely love the SB4s. I'm gonna come back in here, I think, and do a full video talking about the SB4s and maybe some other sneakers as well. If you guys want me to come back in this sneaker store, make sure you guys leave a comment and make sure you guys hit the thumbs up. Make sure you guys smash that like button for me and subscribe right here. We have the black canvas fours. If you guys want me to come back and do another video in here, a full dedicated video in rare pairs, make sure you guys hit that thumbs up and make sure you guys subscribe for more sneaker content. Right here we have trophy room sevens. I have those, the playoff eights. I love the playoff eights. Definitely an OG must have that dropped this year recently. Then we got the sixes. I'm not too crazy about those. Let's see, they have a lot, man. There's so many great, great releases in this store. They have it all. They have a lot. These are hard, man. These SBs. These go hard. They have a lot, man. I'm on my nears. More of these sock. Oh my goodness. These colorways. I don't know if I can do it. I don't know if I can pull that off. Some 350 V2s. Some more 350 V2s that you don't see that often. Cool, cool, cool. The dazzling blue. Yeah, a lot of SBs, man. A lot of sneakers. We can go sneaker shopping in here. It's very easy, I'll say, to spend a bag in here. Maybe do like a no limit sneaker shopping video in here. I think that would be crazy. Let me know what you guys think. Go sneaker shopping. Man, there's a lot. Ooh, I love them. I love them. Love them. 
there's a lot man there's so many grails so many great pairs inside Ooh, so many nice 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 mids you know mids that aren't terrible like these not bad not bad then you have some mids that i'm like what the heck is going on here mocha ones i definitely need another pair man i definitely need another pair 10 and a half 530 not terrible i definitely need another pair i believe that is a consignment pair so they also do consignment but uh, if they own the shoe, they do give me a discount, which is awesome. So yeah, they definitely have a lot. Man, I've spent a lot of money in this store. I've spent thousands of dollars in this store. So they definitely helped me out. They let me record and everything. The store is awesome. Make sure you guys check out Rare Pairs. I love it, I love it, I love it. They have so many great, great pairs. And then they have the heat display. We got a lot of grails in this display right here. There's so much heat, so much money and value in shoes too. Man, they have a lot, but they also have more money in shoes, which I'm going to show you guys right now. Let's go take a look at more than just this. This right here is crazy, but let's take a look at even crazier. Starting off with the fragment ones, as you guys can see, they do have the glitter on them. That's a good sign that it is a legit pair, as well as the breads. I do have those. I did have them. I caught for retail, but unfortunately sold them for like $750. What an L that was. That was market at the time. Then right here we have the... Unions, we got the off lights. I have those, love them. Have these, love them. I have, of course, I hit for retail, I got exclusive access on those grails right there. The fragments, first mochas, I do have, and I have, yeah, the high. Now, here's a grail I don't have the off white Chicago UNC Air Jordan ones. I do have the trophy rooms, I love them. I don't have the 2015 Chicago's, I did, but I don't have them anymore. I did sell them, unfortunately. That is my size. Oh man. 1600 i definitely need those but i'm okay with my lost and found <laughs> so that's cool i do have the trophy rooms those are very very dope and the off whites i need them man i need them but they have a lot of grails in here a lot of must have a lot of heat a lot of money but they have another display with more money let's go take a look this store crazy fire so on the outside of the store we have some heat Ooh, we did take a look at these closer last video i was here but these are absolutely crazy cpfm dunks that we have Ooh. oh man i need them louis vuitton off-white air force one that might be my next big big sneaker purchase because i did recently pick up a pair of the diors no this is not my pair my pair is safe and secure at home don't worry but yes they do have a pair of the diors that have well as well here oh heineken's man heineken sbs this is an sb i do want but i just won't buy because of the age it's really that simple i just won't buy because of how old it is and then we have ah, they escaped me man they escaped but i definitely need them i need them the shattered backboards and the soul flies very dope i do prefer the shatter backboards much better than the soul flies i think the soul flies are cool quality is nice and everything but i think it's a very overrated sneaker colorway and everything i like the shatter backboards much better but yeah there's some grails and heat in here if i had to pick one Louis Vuitton off by air force one right now only because i have the dior I didn't have the Dior be the Dior, but I have them. So I'm gonna go with the Louis Vuitton Off-White Air Force. Comment down below, let me know. What's your grail in this display alone? How much money do you think is here? Comment down below, add it up. Let me know how much money is in this display alone here at Rare Pairs. I found a lot of sneakers today at the mall. Let me know your favorite pair down below in the comments. Make sure you guys smash that like button and make sure you guys comment down below. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button for me. Join the more family. Make sure you guys go cop your do not sell tees. Link down below in the description. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys join the more family. Hit that subscribe button, smash that like button. We're always on the grind. We're never gonna stop always dropping that fire. Straight fire. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you. Have a good day.